So let's take a look at this warm-up activity. With this warm-up activity, we are going to practice how much and how many. Esto es algo que vimos en el nivel anterior. Algunos estaban aquí conmigo, otros están quizás con otro profe. It's okay, no problem. Let's just practice together, okay? Um, y también, vamos, vamos practicando, no problem. Okay, so I need your help. I need your help. Necesito su ayuda. Let's see who is going to help me. I'm going to ask Adriana. Adriana, how can we complete the sentence? Can you please complete the sentence, Adriana? Will we say how much apples are there or how many apples are there, Adriana? What do you say? Creo que Adriana está con nosotros en espíritu. Entonces voy a ir con Andrews. Mr. Sanchez, hello, welcome to class. Oh, Andrews, Hi. how are you? Welcome. Yes, yes I'm fine. Thank you. Uh, Fantastic. English is not, not, not better. <laughs> no problem, Andrews. We are here Thank to you. learn. Estamos aquí para aprender. Ahora, antes de responder, Andrews, y el resto de la clase, les acuerdo que, ¿cómo se utiliza how much y how many? Utilizamos how much para hablar de algo que no es contable. Por ejemplo, ¿qué, es no, qué no es contable en inglés? Eh, todo lo que no es tangible, las emociones, incluso los líquidos, aunque sí son tangibles, los líquidos no se cuentan como algo contable, eh, quizás algo que sea muy pequeño de muchas piezas o pedazos como arena, sal, etc. Uh, y utilizamos how many para hacer preguntas de algo que es contable. So, for example, how many students are in the class? How many teachers are in the class? How many teeth are in your mouth? Etc. Okay, so now, Andrews, I gave you a little yeah. bit of a clue. Uh, what? How do we? How do we complete this sentence? How many apples are there? Very good. Good pronunciation, Andrews. You got it, mm -hmm. my man. Good job. Good job. All right. Let's go to the next person. Let's see. Maybe Caroline. Caroline, can you help me with this one, please? I'm sorry. Repeat, please. Sure. No problem. A ver, ¿cómo podemos completar esta frase aquí? Utilizamos how much or how many? What do you think? How many? Very good. Okay, please read the complete sentence. Lea la frase completa. Okay. Ah, tenía la pantalla aumentada. Ay, no, ya la ah, frase. Yo pensé no que cuál frase. <laughs> No how worries. many sisters have you got? You got? Very, very good. How many sisters have you got? Good job, Caroline. Así mismo. Ahora, debo hacer aquí también eh, una pausa muy corta. Eh, este have you got es muy británico. El inglés americano es más do you have. How many sisters do you have? Y el británico es have you got. Pero quiere decir lo mismo. Very good, Caroline. We say how many sisters have you got is correct. Let's go to the next one. And this one is going to be for uh, Laura. Laura, what do you say here? How can we complete the sentence? Laura, ¿qué me dice? Lady Laura. Du -du 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 -du, Lady Laura. Laura, you with How me? How much water is there? How much yeah. water is there? Very good. How much water is there? Porque la agua no se cuenta. Se cuentan los contenedores, las botellas, etc. Very good, Laura. Yeah. That's it. Very good. How much water is there is correct. Good job, Laura. Okay, let's go to the next one here. This is for Martha. Martha, can you help me with this one, please? How, more, how here, many meat is there in the fried? The fried. In the fridge. All right, Marta, thank you very much. Ahora, aquí. Ahora, normalmente, pues, se podría contar la carne. Sí, se podría contar. Pero así como en español decimos cuánta carne quiere y no cuántas carne quiere. Entonces, okay. en este caso, diríamos. How oh, much? Sí, esto va también mucho, con mucha la comida que se pueda contar, como el queso, etc. We will say how much. Thank you very much, Marta. Fantastic. How much meat is there in the fridge would be correct here. The next question is going to be for Stephanie. Stephanie, what do we say here? How do we complete the sentence, Stephanie? How many lines there are, are there 
Very good. How many oranges are there is correct. Very good because we can count the oranges. Se puede contar las naranjas, right? One, two, three, four, five. Good job, Steph. All right, I'm going to go back to Andrews. Andrews, help me with this one, please. All right, uh, how much uh, juice is there? Very good, good pronunciation, Andrews. How much juice is there is correct. Andrews is on fire. Good job, my man. Let's go now to uh, Caroline. Caroline, help me with this one, please. How much bread have we got? Very good. How much bread have we got? Al igual que el español, aquí diríamos como cuánto, cuánto pan tenemos, no cuántos panes tenemos. Que se podríamos, podríamos usar how many si hay varios pedazos, por así decirlo. I want to say welcome to Gabriel. Hello, Gabriel. Welcome to class. Nice to have you here. Uh, so here we use how much. Very good. Good job. Thank you very much, Caroline. Uh, I'm going to go with Laura. Laura, can you help me with this one, please? Laura, what do we say here? Do we say how much butter is there in the fridge? Or how many butter is there in the fridge, Laura? What do you think? Laura is thinking, what can it be? Let's see. Okay, Laura, if you're not sure, I'm going to go with Martha. Maybe Martha knows. Hey, no, Martha, sorry. can you help me with this question? <laughs> oh, there she is. Sorry, are, teacher. No problem. No problem. <laughs> I'm 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 talking, but I you don't you can't hear me. Yes, yeah, sorry. Okay, no problem, Laura. So what do we do here? Um, I'm not sure, but I think this is how many butter is there in the fridge. Okay, think about how we say this in Spanish, Laura. In Spanish, in Spanish, would we say cuánta mantequilla hay o cuántas mantequillas hay? What do you think? Cuánta. Right, cuánta. So in this case, we use how much. Right. Yeah, Good job, Laura. Thank you very much. Fantastic. Good job. I'm going to go now with uh with Martha. Martha, can you help me with this one, please? How much sugar is there? Very good. How much sugar is there is correct. All right. I'm going to go now with uh Stephanie. Stephanie, how can you uh help me with this sentence, please? How many? Uh, and how many, how many continue tomatoes? tomatoes do you need to make a salad? Very good. How many tomatoes do you need to make a salad? Ya, aquí utilizamos how many? Porque mire que son tomates plural. ¿Cuántos tomates? Good job. All right, all right. Uh, Gabriel, um, you want to try one, Gabriel? Maybe you can try this one. Oh, Gabriel, se le está conectando el audio. All right, I'm going to do this one y terminamos eh, esta actividad. So, biscuits. Ahora, en inglés americano, business biscuits son como unos panes específicos, pero en inglés británico, biscuits son galletas. So, here we're going to say, how many biscuits do you want? All right. All right, guys, let's stop there. And let's continue. That was just to warm up a little bit.